Nothing enough to say, like period, 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 period. Y'all, these freaking braces and the way that the rubber bands are are like I'm really scratching up my tongue. They got me having a list right now, like, ugh. But anyway, happy freaking Monday, y'all. I'm super pumped. I'm super stoked. I don't know what the title of this video is, but today, um, I just left the gym. It's 8.02. I went to the gym early. Um, I had a couple days off from the gym, y'all, because I just needed a break. So today is my first day back in the gym for the week, y'all. I am um, back on keto. I'm back on keto. And um, I'm back fasting. I told y'all in my last vlog that I am doing a 21 day challenge with my girl Deja Fit Beauty. Um, click the link in my description box below so that you can go ahead. <clears throat> <clears throat> click the link in my description box below so you can go ahead and sign up. Use my code Danny10 so you can save some coin. But I opted to do a 21 day challenge with my girl Deja Fit Beauty so that I can um get back strict on myself y'all because i have been too lax and i have been seeing it and i don't like it so um i she had three different options she had a low carb option a keto option and a balanced option and keto is my roots y'all so i decided to do her keto option will i stay on keto after this i don't know but i decided to do the keto option so yeah it is monday the challenge does not officially start to august 8th our ninth today is july 26 and i just wanted to get like a jump start on it because i don't want to be culture shocked when the challenge does come and you know so yeah i just decided to start now and get my body used to being back on keto and stuff so yeah i am officially back on keto today is day two yesterday i did a 18 hour fast and then I had a salad, and then baby and I went to the movies, and in the previous clip, you saw the salad I had. It was just the grilled chicken salad, the blue salad from Zaxby's. It has some um, blue cheese crumbles on top, and I had a Diet Pepsi at the movies. Um, and now this morning, I have not ate anything. I'm about to go inside of Walmart and get like a bell pepper, some mozzarella cheese, because it's Monday, so it's my night to cook. And I'm doing Philly cheese steaks. I'm going back to my basics. So I'm actually super, super pumped. So I'm gonna take y'all with me. We're gonna go inside, grab a couple of my keto staples because I looked in the house and I literally have nothing keto. But I'm actually really pumped um i'm also really pumped because i started my chirology system and uh, i'm super excited to see where my skin is gonna go so yeah y'all uh it's eight o'clock i have to be at work at 11 so i have a couple hours to kind of like grab some groceries get home shower and get ready for work so yeah i just wanted to come walk y'all to the vlog and let y'all know what was going on i know y'all missed my keto vlogs my keto videos so we're back and i don't know if if that break was long enough to excite me back about keto or what, but we back. So let's go inside and get like just a couple keto things. Really, I'm coming in here for dinner and then I'll just grab like some keto staples that I used to get because I just noticed like I have no keto snacks. So let's go. We just go in the uh, Walmart neighborhood market, y'all. I always prefer to just go up in here because, listen, 
the um big Walmart. Mm -mm. Ain't nobody got time, so let's go. Hey, I really just want a little buggy. Mm -mm. Let's see. Do y'all have like the basket? Just a small hand basket? No. Okay. Oh. Yeah. I don't want to make a sound. Okay. Thank you. Ooh, flowers. Babe always give me flowers, so. Thank you so much. All right, y'all, so just gonna get a couple staples. I'm gonna set y'all up and we gonna grab some stuff. So really quick just made it back from the store i literally kind of told you guys um a little bit in my last vlog as well as earlier in this vlog um i ran to walmart and got just a couple of keto staples because i literally had nothing at the crib like i looked last night i had none of my staples and i had to grab a couple things for dinner tonight um so yeah i know a lot of y'all are probably jumping for joy as y'all watch this um so yeah i'm just gonna show you guys a couple things that i got because i need to get ready for work but let me just show you guys what i picked up so if y'all know these are oldie but goodies these are the joseph um oat pita breads these are what i used to make my little flatbread bread pizzas on all the time and um macros are bomb i used to just make them all the time they have nine carbs um and two dietary fibers and i used to, used to put my pizza sauce on here my toppings put them in the oven so good um i picked up my favorite halo top peanut butter chocolate ice creams um they only have three carbs per ice cream it's chocolate and then caramel ice cream in the middle y'all already know staples gotta have them um i picked up just a bag of cauliflower rice um just in case babe cooks rice or something i'll already have an option in the fridge um like i told y'all this is going to be day two back on keto um i fasted 17 hours yesterday and i'm at about 12 hours today and i'm gonna try to fast 17 to 18 hours today i got some mozzarella cheese because i wasn't sure if we had any because i think i'm doing philly cheesesteaks tonight um i got two packs of ground turkey because they were on sale i picked up this berry blast energy drink enhancer to keep in my purse i got some minced garlic i also picked up these powerful bites these are actually on sale they were 1.99 um i only got one of them because at that price point i don't know if they're good but they're peanut butter and chocolate um per cup 36 grams of per protein they only have three grams of net carbs per serving 36 grams of protein and 130 calories 
and 10 grams of fat. So if these are good, this will literally be the perfect um, protein source, no sugar added. And this is what they look like, literally like little peanut butter bites. Um, so yeah, I picked these up. Y'all let me know if y'all have had these. Then I just got an onion and a bell pepper. I got some pork rinds because it's a lot of temptation around here. We got Doritos, we got Cheetos. So I got some pork rinds. I got the hog wild barbecue. I got, um, some peach mango green tea drinks. And then I got some, um, veggie burgers. Cause I think on, um, Wednesday I want to do veggie burgers. So that's my little haul. I'm about to get ready for work and I'll see you guys later on. All right, gang, so back to the basics. I'm on my lunch break and y'all know I used to get this all the time. This is one of those healthy choice meals. 28 grams of protein, four carbs, and yeah, it's like that chicken Alfredo um, bowl and no pasta or anything. I used to get these all the time. When I say going back to the basics, literally going back to the basics, this was one of my holy grails. So delicious, so filling. And yeah, I just ended a 20 hour fast. I'll put it on the side of the screen uh, my fast time. But yeah, I just ended that fast and I am about to eat this. And then I'm going to run in Target because I'm making Philly cheesesteaks for dinner and I need to get some steak seasoning. And I'm probably going to get some Quest chips like as a little snack. But yeah, this is what I'm eating. And yep, I used to eat these all the time. I think I still got the box right here. Let me show y'all. Well, I ripped the box. But yeah, it's just one of those healthy choice broccoli, grilled chicken and broccoli Alfredo. So I'm about to eat this and then I will see you guys for dinner. So yeah, y'all, I just went to Target on my lunch break and I was gonna get some Quest chips, but I forgot they don't sell them individually. So I got a box of Quest cookies. I'll show y'all. So I got some Quest cookies. I'm about to eat half of a chocolate chip cookie. And then y'all know Holy Grail and back on my keto-ish. And it's actually exciting and it feels really good. But anyway, 15 grams of protein. I'm going to eat half of it. Four net carbs, um, less than a gram of sugar. So I'm going to eat half of one of these um, on my way back into work. And then I picked up some McCormick Grill Mates hamburger seasoning um, because I'm going to make burgers one day this week. And then I also picked up some um steak seasoning because like i said i make a philly cheesesteaks tonight so i picked this up actually i'm pretty full and that's another thing i'm gonna work on i'm not hungry so i'm not gonna eat half a cookie i'm gonna just take these home so yeah that's another thing i'm gonna work on y'all not eating when i'm not hungry so <sighs> i'm gonna head back into work and i'll see you guys for dinner all right, gang, dinner time. Back to the mother freaking basics. So tonight is my night to cook. So I'm doing Philly cheese steaks like I used to. So all I did was take the rest of the steakums that I had in the freezer. Y'all know this was one of my staple meals. So I always keep steakums on deck. So I put like eight sheets on here because it's for babe and me. So I put um, eight sheets of steakums on the pan and I'm just kind of letting that cook up. Then I just sliced up some bell peppers and onions. Um, Y'all saw me get that earlier. And I just let that cook down first and then I seasoned that up. Um, and then I seasoned up the um, steak with this Montreal steak seasoning that I got from Target. And then I just put a little onion powder on there. And y'all know a little salt, pepper, all that good stuff. Um, and then for our wraps, we're going to be using the carb balanced flour tortillas. These have four net carbs, 70 calories per wrap. And then I also have the tiny ones that have three carbs. Um, I like to put mayo on my Philly cheese steak. So I have just some Harris Teeter mayo. And then I have some mozzarella cheese that I'm going to sprinkle on top. And then I'm going to put some fries in the air fryer for babe. I'm not going to have any fries um, going into three, day three back on keto. Um, so I feel pretty good. But yeah, this is just one of my staples. Obviously, I didn't show y'all how I cooked it because it's super simple. You literally just put the steakums on the pan and let it cook down. And then I just kind of, um, you know, beat it with a spoon until it kind of 
breaks apart and then i kind of just cook it until the water cooks out then i put cheese on top and then i just let babe assemble his own philly cheese steak and then i assemble my own so yeah once the water cooks out i'll sprinkle cheese on top let that melt and then i'll cover it until we're ready to eat and then i'll just put a handful of fries in the air fryer for him y'all i'm feeling really good um on lunch i showed y'all what i ate um this is what I had. I had threw the box away. Well, the box was like ripped open, so I couldn't show y'all. But this is what I had for lunch. The Healthy Choice Simply Steamers um, Grilled Chicken and Broccoli Alfredo. Y'all already know. I used to get these all the time when I worked in it. When I lived in Atlanta and worked um, in Buckhead. Here are the macros. So, yeah. I keep these on deck, too, when I'm on keto. So, yeah. I'm just going to continue to let this cook. Like I said, I'll put the cheese on top in a minute and then I'll just put it on low and cover it. And then whenever we're ready to eat, I'm going to put some Kerrygold butter in here and crisp up my tortilla and then make babe some fries and that'll be dinner. Like I said, y'all, super quick, super easy. All right, gang, so this is what it looks like. I just melted some mozzarella cheese. You can use provolone or whatever you like. And then there are just the bell peppers and onions. So yeah, in this skillet, I'm just melting some Kerrygold butter. I'm gonna um, put my tortilla in here to crisp it up. And then I'm going to show you guys what it looks like in the end. If you watch me, I make this all the time, but if you're new here, I'll show you guys what it looks like when I'm done. It's 9.49 and Babe and I are about to have a cup of tea and go to bed. We are trying to go to sleep earlier. And yeah, so we are about to have some sleepy time tea. This is the sleepy time immune boost tea with vitamin C and zinc. I am going to have a cup. I put um, a little bit of lemon, lemon in my cup. I put lemon and honey in his cup. Two tea bags in each of our cups. And I put honey in his cup. Happy Tuesday. I'm finna go on Aldi. I just left the gym and I'm finna go in here and just see what I can see. All right, gang. So I'm about to break my fast, 18 hour fast. I'm about to eat literally um, the rest of what I had left over from last night. It was my night to cook, so I made Philly cheesesteak. So I have the rest of that cheesesteak meat with just some cheese on top and some bell peppers and onions. And then I'm gonna eat a couple of these Quest chips. I have some barbecue Quest chips with, well, yeah, some barbecue Quest chips. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna eat some of these. Probably not the whole bag, but I am gonna eat some of them. And I have a bottle of water that I'm gonna put a flavor pack in. I'm not that hungry. Like y'all, when you start fasting, you don't be that hungry. And I also been sipping on a Lani New um, energy drink, like the beginning of my shift. So I'm not that hungry, but I'm about to eat anyway because I gotta work all the way to eight o'clock and it is only freaking three o'clock and I don't wanna get hungry like in my shift. But yeah, I am about to eat this um, meat. Really, it's literally just like a very little bit, but I'm about to eat this and eat some of these chips. It's Tuesday, so I already know it's Taco Tuesday, but yeah, I'm just showing y'all like what I eat like in a couple days. So yeah, these chips are bomb. So yeah, I'm gonna eat some of these with this meat. Mm-hmm. These are so bomb. Four net carbs, a bag, protein, and water.
So I'm about to go ahead and end this vlog, but I, I wanted to end it on a good note. So it is Wednesday at 6.34 and um, it was my night to cook. So we had tacos. I showed y'all what we ate last night, which was Babe's night. He had um, a banchan. He had wings, but y'all saw he got me a salmon salad. So tonight I did tacos. So I got myself two tacos on low carb wrap. So inside I have some um, ground turkey with some cheese. I also put a little dollop of queso on this plate. I just have some onions, some lettuce, and I'm gonna squeeze some lime on top right here i have some salsa i'm gonna put a little salsa on top with a little bit of ranch and then to drink i have a sprite zero with a glass straw um so yeah i'm gonna add me some lettuce inside on my tacos y'all i am starving because y'all saw earlier i had to go to a convention at work i did get me a um starbucks drink and that is all i have had i'll put on the side of the screen how long i have been fasting y'all i have been fasting all day literally all i had was like a little starbucks drink and that was it um i do have some lime i'm gonna squeeze on my drink and then like i said i'm gonna put a little bit of salsa on this taco y'all i'm literally so famished i might eat another taco but that is literally all i have had so anyway y'all i'm gonna go ahead and eat these tacos i just wanted to film this video this video is just an introduction of what i eat in a couple days on keto i'm back but yeah i'm about to go ahead and eat hopefully you guys have enjoyed um seeing what i eat back on keto if you guys like this video if you guys want to see more of what i eat on keto then go ahead press subscribe press like and i will see you guys in the next one again if you guys want to join the challenge then click the link in the bio and um join the challenge with me but yeah this is what the taco looks like on a low carb wrap and yeah i put them in the air fryer to crisp them up and this is what they look like yum if you made it all the way to the end of the video go ahead and drop the little smiley face down below because i'm back on keto and it actually feels really good see y'all in my next video